what's going on guys welcome to the gadget chameleon uh today we're going to be unboxing this it's an acer 23 inch um led monitor uh we've got two of these so we're going to unbox those see what you get in the box so a bit more prepared than i have been in the past now i've heard you do get all the necessary cables this is a um, full 1080p monitor with HDMI, DVI, and VGA inputs um, with LED technology. So here we get a power cable, that's always handy. There is the part of the stand, kettle lead standard. Oh, European kettle lead, some polystyrene. The monitor itself, we put that to one side. DVI cable, brilliant. Lots of manuals, all that sort of stuff, brilliant reading material. A VGA cable. You don't see a lot of those nowadays. Hold on. Come on. Here is the stand. Fantastic. I thought they came with an HDMI. It obviously does not. And now here is the monitor itself. Hopefully that is on par. Okay. Um, it's really. Um, ultra thin due to this like LED technology so that's always handy and what we're going to do is have dual monitors set up with both HDMI and DVI input for a Mac and a Windows setup so we just have to flick the in get different inputs um, and we could go from Mac to Windows these are very, very thin, thin sort of monitors. I don't know if you can see that on the screen. And really nice size. So two of these will go up on the desk and we'll show you the whole setup uh, with the power of movie magic. Right, okay, so we've set them all up. Um, I've actually been using this for quite a while. I'm only filming this maybe two weeks after. I bought the two monitors, so I wanted to give them a good try out, make sure they worked. But as you see, I've got one my MacBook Pro there is hooked up to both of the monitors and they sort of each is an independent screen. So I use the center monitor as the main the main monitor and then I use one for sort of music or a video or whatever as goes on the on the right and then the I use the MacBook Pro's monitor as sort of a whatever I want to do to play Minecraft there. <clears throat> so this is basically just showing you the setup. There's a TV behind the MacBook Pro, but that 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 solely run off the Xbox there. But if I wanted to, I could use the inbuilt HDMI of the Mac and uh, run a, a a third or fourth monitor, depending on how you see it, um, through the through the MacBook Pro's graphics card. So let's see if we can't show you. Here we have the. Uh, I'm using two DVI adapters, so these take out out the signal from the Thunderbolt port there and run them through to DVI adapters and then those go straight into the monitors themselves which is a t full 1080p resolution which is nice. Now what I said before was I wanted to link up a Windows PC and have the Windows running through HDMI. I have done that and the monitors you can switch them very easily. Yes yeah, so this is kind of the setup so far. It's worked well as I said I've had this for two weeks now since filming the unboxing which you should have probably just watched. And uh, yeah, it's working phenomenally. I, ha I don't use Windows that much, but the idea is to build a custom PC and then have sort of Mac on one side and Windows on the HDMI side of things so the, 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 the custom built PC can go under the desk. Uh, also, one thing to mention, these monitors can also play Xbox, but you will need some sort of uh, audio out from the Xbox. I used I used uh, optical cable, I think it is, optical cable out of the Xbox and run that into a dedicated sound system over there. So that's one thing you do want to consider if you're going to use these monitors for playing Xbox and things. But they do work, it's quite impressive. If you know They're a lot cheaper than a TV as well and you just want to use it for Xbox, then this is uh, definitely something you should consider. So if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments down below, I should answer them. Thank you for watching and thank you for looking at the setup. If you hit that like button, that would be great. And uh, I'll see you in the next one.